Hello, I'm Dave from DaveStepTats.com. Today we're going to go through how I set up uh, my airbrush stand. So you can see I have everything laid on the table here. We're using Peak X3 airbrushes, uh, hoses from Bare Air. I've got my Stanley Rolling Toolbox. My air source today is uh, carbon dioxide. I've got a 20 pound cylinder uh, with a regulator that I got at the local Walton Supply Shop. Uh, and inks from EBA, European Body Art. So to start, we will hook up the manifold to our air source. Using the quick connects. Right now I have the cylinder turned off. Uh, our air pressure is always set at thir about 30 pounds. Next we'll set up the airbrushes. For demonstration purposes we're just going to set up three today. Make sure the hoses are untangled. Put the airbrushes on the end. And connect them to our manifold. And we can set this down. Now we can turn the air pressure on. Got a bad quick connect, so we'll fill that one. All right. So now we've got pressure to the guns. I've got my stand that I set up. I just have Velcro on here. I put that right on the toolbox. So this is what I'll spray off of. And then my airbrush. Holder. This is uh, inspired by Star Shields. That's Velcro down. So then I just hook up my ink bottles. I always spray alcohol through first, make sure the gums are nice and clean. <coughs> then you can hook up the paint. In good shape. Get the paint flowing. And we're ready to go. Move that to our next. Usually when I'm in a big event, I'll set up uh, eight. 8 to 10 airbrushes depending on uh, what colors I'm going to use. And then I can like blend the colors together afterwards. And one more. All right, and then from there we're ready to spray. We can uh, let people come up and we're ready to do tattoos. That's it.